to my channel. As the title of the video implies, you're going to be learning how to get a pink nipple today. Now, just as it's important for you to take care of the face and the hair and the part of the body that's mostly seen, it is also pertinent that you care for the nipple because this is going to give you extra freshness over here and it's going to enhance your sexual life. So you know how you feel when you are fresh all over the body it's going to give you that feeling and guess what everything we're going to be used to are home remedies things you can easily lay hands on and you should feel freshness all around this is going to help the elasticity of your breast it's going to help your breast kind of firm and trust me this will be one of the most thoughtful things you've done in a while so guys before we go on to the video of the day i really want to appreciate you for always been there if this is your first time thank you for stopping by before we go on please hit on the subscribe button if you've not done so and subscribe to my channel and also turn on the notification bell that way you get notifications whenever new videos are uploaded on the pretty hot tv am i singing already okay i don't want to sing so guys it's all interesting to know that some persons are born with jack nipples while all that along the line they tend to develop dark nipples through puberty through childbirth breastfeeding and all of that a lot of things can cause you to have dark nipples ignoring your nipple thinking that it's just one part of the body that's inside and no one sees except in the private room can also lead you to having a dark nipple so right now from now you're going to be taking proper care of your nipple and that's what i'm here to share with you today so the ingredients we're going to use like i said earlier things you can easily lay and so on and you should be grateful that you did this video is going to be as short as possible so we have a lot of things that's been used over time to get a pink nipple but i'm going to share with you what i have personally tried out though personally i don't have dark nipples i have a kind of pinkish purple pink purple kind of nipple <laughs> so i'm going to share with you how to achieve that and we are using some ingredients here today the first thing you should get is to get an empty bowl and a measurement spoon because you're going to use this one to mix all ingredients together and you're going to use this for your measurements and we are going to be using yogurt this is unsweetened yogurt and this one is going to help the elasticity of your breast is going to help your breasts really look fresher than it used to look that's why we are using this one and the second ingredient we are going to be using is lemon we are going to be using lemon for this because lemon has lesion properties it has antioxidants in here that will help you lighten the breath and it's really safe for you to use and the third thing you're going to be needing is that you're going to be needing olive oil now this olive oil is going to help the breast firm you're going to get your lemon you're going to open your lemon with the knife you're going to cut into two thereafter you're going to get your measurement spoon and you're getting teaspoons of your lemon so i'm going to squeeze the lemon directly into the measurement spoon And here we have one teaspoon. And then, and then we have the second teaspoon of lemon. You're just going to stay it and try and remove any seed if there is any. The next thing you want to do is to get the sweetened yogurt and two teaspoons so here is the first teaspoon and the second you're going to mix these two together generously. 
after mixing these two together, here's the consistency you will have. Then you're going to get a cutting bowl. Get a little portion. I don't want to dip the cutting bowl inside of this because I'm going to be using this for a number of times. This with the lemon, the lemon can preserve it, but it's better you preserve it in a refrigerator. You're going to get your cutting bowl. And you're going to use this to rub your nipples. So here is what you will do. Use it to rub your nipple. Rub it generously for about two minutes. And you are going to rub the second nipple. So you rub this for about the first one of the nipples for about two minutes. Rub the other for about two minutes and you're going to leave it to stay on it for five minutes again. After five minutes, you are going to wash this off. It is good whether or not you want a pink nipple or you want to firm your breast or you want to get rid of stretch mark irrespective of all of this it's good that you use oil any of the carrier oil you can use olive oil you can use jojoba you can use coconut oil you can use almond oil to rub your breast so after washing up you're going to get some olive oil or any of the oils i've mentioned and you're going to rub your breasts generously with it you're rubbing the old breast with it now this is going to give your breast extra freshness. Now as I'm rubbing this on my hand, I can feel it already. I can feel like a kind of freshness already. Now this is also going to help the blood circulation. So make sure you massage the breast with it for about two to three minutes. Massage it. In and you should have extra breast freshness. Do this every morning and every evening for about a week. You should get results like good results. So you can decide to pause a while and continue again if you really want extra freshness and that pink nipple that you desire. That's it. I really want to get your feedback on this one. And if this video was helpful to you, don't forget to give it a thumb up. And don't forget to subscribe to my channel before you check out. And you want to really share this video on all your social media platforms. Because you never might know whom this video will just be helpful to. I'll see you guys in my next video. But until I come your way again, always remember to stay pretty. Because everything is pretty, pretty, pretty. I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye. -bye.